Hey guys, I actually just filmed a Tiger Salamander Care video, which is extensive. Um, it took me an hour and 11 minutes to film. So I hope it's a bit shorter than that when I post it. Um, yes, thank you, Jackson. But I wanted to also make a 10 reasons why I love Tiger Salamanders video because in the past I made a 10 reasons why I love leopard geckos. And it was well received and it also was fun because I got to share a lot of cute clips. So I figured I'll make a 10 reasons why I love Tiger Salamanders and share cute clips of Neville because she's an angel and she's also a drama queen and we love her. Oh yeah, before I get started, I'm supposed to say subscribe, hit the notification bell and all that good stuff. And um, I always say that at the end, but most people have left by the end. So you're supposed to say it at the beginning. So I'm saying it at the beginning. Please subscribe. I appreciate it. Thank you. Anyways, back to what I'm saying. So the first thing that I love about tiger salamanders is that they have huge personalities. Like I said, Neville is a drama queen, a drama queen through and through. She's super active, she's super personable, she loves being around me. I love her personality, I love it. Number two is that they're easy to care for. Literally so easy to care for. Pretty low maintenance, pretty inexpensive, definitely a plus. Number three is their appearance. Tiger salamanders are so goofy looking and I love it. Like they have these like, big strong stout legs and these really far apart goofy looking eyes and they have smiles and really flat heads oh my god they're so funny the way that they look the way they move they are so funny and i love i just love it like even if neville didn't have a great personality i could just enjoy watching her move around because she's so goofy looking number four they have great appetites neville loves food all tiger salamanders love food they eat anything you put in front of them no matter if it's good for them or not they eat anything even if it's too big for them like they love food and i can relate i can relate but it's just nice to have an animal that like will never really turn down food you can always trust them to eat and they're so funny to watch eat because they like open their mouth and inhale food five i kind of already mentioned they're fun to watch neville is just like super active if i'm just like sitting in my bed sometimes i'll look over and see her just scampering around her enclosure going and diving into her water section or climbing out of it like a bumbling fool like the way they move their bodies is so funny so yes just sitting there and watching them even if i'm not like in front of the enclosure but if i'm at the other side of the room is a blast so number six they are relatively active and the reason i like that is because a lot of pets you keep especially if they're burrowing species which tiger salamanders are they don't like the attention they don't really do a lot above the substrate but tiger salamanders and Neville in particular often do and I can only really speak to my experience with Neville but I have heard that tiger salamanders are some more active species of salamander just because they're like super big and super interested in food and like what's going on outside the enclosure so it's nice to have an animal that's active even though they're also a burrower because like I said burrowers tend to be just like beneath the substrate a lot and you don't really see them. Tiger salamanders are also a great size and what I mean by that is like they're not too tiny and they're not too big like they're a perfect medium sized of reptile or amphibian well, obviously they're amphibians but i like medium sized reptiles and amphibians in general like for example leopard geckos are like the perfect size because they're a nice compact reptile but they're not so small like a viper gecko which is like super tiny or a morning gecko which is super tiny i like medium sized things i don't want one that's super tiny because i'm afraid it'll get away from me and be gone and i don't want one that's really big because i'm kind of intimidated by being bitten by the big ones which are usually like you know very painful <laughs> and make you bleed <laughs> plus big reptiles are hard to house compared to smaller ones like they take up a lot more room and their poops are massive Another thing I like about tiger salamanders is that they enjoy lounging in the water and I really like aquatic and semi-aquatic species. I don't know why I'm pulled to them. They're more work usually, but I just find that Neville is just so precious when she's like bloop into her water section and then she just kind of waddles her way to the front where she likes to take a nap. Like she'll literally just fall asleep and nap in her water section and I just find that really endearing. Another thing I like, which is I think number nine, is that they thrive in cooler temperatures so like you don't need to always be maintaining like a high temperature for them and they can live at room temperature which is really easy so again that that probably lends more to like the maintenance side of it but it's just nice to have something that doesn't need a heater like everything else needs a heater in this house but not neville and number 10 which can it be a benefit, but it can also be bad because I've seen people who use simplistic enclosure for their tiger salamanders and they're like what I would consider kind of like lackluster for a tiger salamander. But the simplistic aspect of Neville's enclosure made it really fun to build. 
because it's just dirt like the whole bottom is just dirt and then there's a nice and simple diy background a cork hide a cork round with a plant in it and her water like it's it's so simple but still satisfying if you know what i mean and that's 10 things that i love about tiger salamanders i hope you enjoyed this video if you did let me know by leaving a like or a comment or by subscribing or by hitting that notification bell or by doing jackson made a ripple in the background <laughs> or by doing all four Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Stop lunging at the top of the enclosure. Ow!